you guys are really amazing. Uh, by the time this goes up, I'm either going to be close to 1100 or over 1100, and I really appreciate it. And let's just let's just count this as some kind of special, and because this is different, you know. I used to do battles like this all the time back in the day, and I was watching Neko Stevo, and I. I, I was like, man, when the last time I did a theme battle? So, I decided to make a Sesame Street team. I got Bert, Ernie, Snuffleupagus, The Count, Big Bird, and um, Oscar. And she has things in... Oh my god, is that a light bird again? <laughs> Don't hurt me! Don't hurt me! Oh, okay, sorry. I thought something happened. Anyway, um, yeah. So, hopefully... Uh, Sesame Street has the power to overcome that obstacle, plus whatever else she has. So, yeah, let's get let's go, let's get started. Oh my God! All right, I'm gonna start over Oscar because I am defensive. I have this as my defensive bulky poke and um, throw as my special defensive. So, hopefully, you know they can help cover each other's weaknesses. Kind of, not really, but it doesn't matter. She's gonna start off with. Um, a samurai. I do. I do get a later spikes. I have the Giga Drain. I have is Giga Drain, uh, Drain Punch, and something. I'm draining a lot. I just realized that <laughs> draining. It's such a grouch. He just drains the life out of people. So um, I, I don't want to take another special hit. So I'm going into my throw because it's especially defensive. Max HP. I have bulk up all that shenanigans. The, the, the set that sweeps teams and in, in you. If you are not ready for throw, aka Ernie. So I set up a bulk up as she sets up the, the sub with Golurk and I'm like, oh, it's a focus punch. It's not going to do much because I'm going to get another bulk up right here. So, yeah, I'm like, come on, bro. Come at me. What do you got, Golurk? Iron Giant, whatever. You rusty piece of bolt and stuff. And Oh, my God, you crit me. Oh, no. No, not this again. It's, it's, it's happening again. It's happening again. I Like, okay, you like, oh, well, you got glide score. As long as she doesn't have ice punch, it's fine. No, this is not that kind of glide score. Um, it's just, it's the acrobat glide score. <laughs> the one that you can't really utilize as much unless you're running Sand Veil with T Tar and all this stuff. But I haven't used it in a long time and I wanted to use it again. And so I kind of had to sacrifice glide score in order to um, get this goal alert from under, from behind a sub. You know, I got Earthquake, she does the side punch, and uh, I do acrobatics, and that thing barely lives, unfortunately. Even with the flight gem. And, and the boost from um, acrobatics is still a barely lives, but that's good enough because Oscar can come out here and drain the fun out of it and, and take that out for the rest of the game. And Oscar is looking actually pretty decent, and he's, he's been doing a good job right now. You know, he is a grouch, but you know, he knows when he needs to get serious. So um, out comes this, uh, what is it, Dino, I believe it's called, or something like that. Go straight for the Outrage. Oscar, like I said, physically defensive, can take that. Like, it's his job, and, and in this case, it is his job. And I, I just drain punch to get my health back, so I can definitely take another one. So, 101, Oscar did, was able to uh, take out this dragon. Not bad, not bad for not having any steel types, right? So, you know, Oscar is not looking the best right now, but, you know, it, I'm getting a good momentum. Um, she's going to bring out the Samurai again. I don't want to give her a free, sh a free sub, and she did see Giga Drain, so she's going to go ahead and just go straight to take me out. Now, I go into Big Bird. I know that the Totera is obvious, so I'm just going to go for the Heat Wave. If not, I think it, it was at a level, uh, Samurai was at the amount of health that Heat Wave might have taken it out. I do have Life Orb, so that could have been a thing. And Totera is beast. It actually takes this Heat Wave. And I'm just going to finish it off with a Empire Grass. And uh, that's going to be it. So um, I think she goes out into a Dino. And I don't want to be like Life Orb stalled. I don't remember if I have Roost or not. I'm pretty sure I do. But I went straight into Snuffy. Snuffy left because comes in. And he's going to take that T-Wave like it's nothing. And then dish out an Earthquake. Now it barely, barely does over half. But once again Life Orb. And um, I, if she got Wish she probably got Protect. So... <clears throat> I'm gonna see how much uh, Wish gives her back. Oh, I predicted to protect and went for the Stealth Rocks. Oh my god, look at me being a beast in this game. No, I'm just kidding. So, uh, with the combination of the Wish and um, Leftover, she is probably just taking like 2% damage. And I could stay in and hope for a crit or something, but uh, with protection, with, yeah, with protect 
and um, and wish and leftovers and all this stuff. It, I'm just finding losing battles. So I'm going to my my um, sock, aka Bert, and um, he's actually got he's actually torf scarf, but I'm gonna sacrifice the scarf because I don't really think it's necessary for me to win uh, to get a toxic on this. And he's like, well, why are you getting a toxic off if this thing has heal bell? Uh, or potentially has heal bell. And I'm like, because she's gonna have to make it. Eventually, she's gonna have to make a choice. She doesn't know I'm scarf. Uh, she sees the toxic. I could easily go for close combat right now, but I'm gonna double switch back out to Snuffy, and uh, I'm put uh, when when something happens, either she's gonna have to choose the heal bell or she's gonna have to choose the wish. And when that happens, I'm gonna bring back out Sock and go for the close combat. Now this thing comes back. <gasps> oh, sorry. I I thought we had a clip. We didn't. We didn't have a clip, sorry. I, I apologize. So this thing comes out, and it actually doesn't do anything <laughs> other than Life Orb um, stalls me. Stalls me. What did it do? I, I was, I was so dumbfounded about not having a clip. I didn't know what the, what happened. So all she has left is Aldino. She can easily um, go for the wish and stuff, but she is toxic, so she has to go for Hill Bell and hope she can live a close combat, which she cannot live a close combat. So that will be my game. The Power of Sesame Street. Um, is is strong? Yeah, it is strong. So I'm I'm pretty happy about that. I might change glass score up or something. I don't know. Um, make make some suggestions if you think some Pokemon are very um, Sesame Street like characters. Then make some suggestions. I can make um you know changes to his team, put st take stuff out, add stuff in, blah blah blah. Anyway, thank you so much for 1100 subs or ish, uh, 1100 ish subs, and I really appreciate it. I hope you enjoyed the video, and please enjoy the rest of my content. Um, Injustice is going to be kind of coming out really soon. Um, Naruto and you know my Pokemon battles and whatever else I put out. So hopefully you enjoyed, and you like and comment. I'll see you next time. Peace.